Trump ordered Mar-a-Lago staff to rip out Melania's redecorations to his private quarters when he returned for Christmas, report says. President Donald Trump returned to his beachside Mar-a-Lago resort for a restful Christmas break last week but was so displeased with redecorations overseen by his wife, Melania Trump, that he ordered them to be torn out, CNN reported. He was not happy with it, a source told CNN, adding that Trump berated resort staff members upon arrival, telling them to remove white marble and an abundance of dark wood. The staff quickly obliged the president's order. CNN said. Trump and the First Lady landed in Palm Beach, Florida, last Wednesday and are expected to return to Washington in the new year. The renovations were dreamed up and overseen by the First Lady and her interior decorator, Tham Kinnikum, according to CNN. ABC News was first to report that Mar-a-Lago was being renovated in November. In December, People magazine reported that the president's quarters would be expanded and spruced up to make it larger more modern, and comfortable. Trump is said to be planning to settle in Florida after his presidential term ends next month. It would not be the first time Melania Trump's interior design efforts had gone unappreciated by her husband. CNN said Trump took issue with renovations overseen by the First Lady at Camp David, the Maryland country retreat of U.S. presidents, when he visited for Thanksgiving. Just before taking office in 2016, Trump told journalists that Camp David was very rustic but didn't express enthusiasm at visiting. You know how long you'd like it? He said. For about 30 minutes. An unnamed club source told CNN that Trump had been moody throughout his latest stay at Mar-a-Lago, with another source saying, the vibe is off. Trump was said to have emerged Monday night, however, to say hello and congratulate a couple who had just been married at the resort, CNN reported. It is expected, however, that Trump will move back to Mar-a-Lago. In November, U.S. Secret Service agents working on the president's detail were asked whether they'd accept a transfer to Palm Beach, Florida, ABC News reported. Even before his election loss, Trump and the First Lady took steps to deepen their ties with Florida. In September 2019, the pair changed their primary residence status from New York City to Palm Beach.